Hi friends, Fire on Pop here, and today uh, I have another drill for it, for you today, and uh, it's a practice, practice, practice. And I saw this in the magazine, thought it was uh, ideal. And uh, anyway, it's called the failure drill. And uh, <clears throat> one of the interesting comments here says most people who have been exposed to defensive shooting techniques have heard the little slogan: uh, two to the body, one to the head is guaranteed to leave them dead. Uh, <clears throat> once again, I'll repeat it. Two to the body, one to the head is guaranteed to leave them dead. Now, I mean, the article goes on to say uh, this was in the Mozambique, okay, uh, war and uh, for independence, and that's where this technique was developed. Uh, and the purpose of it is this. If you try to go for a headshot right away, the head's probably moving the most and it's the smallest target. So you don't want to hit that uh, uh, or aim for that immediately. You want to put two to the body as quickly as possible, reassess the threat, and fire one to the head if necessary. Uh, now, most of the times, two to the body should stop them. If it doesn't, if it will at least slow them down enough so you can get a clean headshot. And that is guaranteed to leave them dead. So, uh, haven't done this before. We're going to go right on video doing it. Uh, so, I'm learning as I go. I've never tried it. Good, need some muscle memory, which I'll probably try first. And, uh, and go from there. So, stay tuned. By the way, today I'm using my Walter PPS. It's a 9mm. Uh, I, I like this gun a lot. I've done a full review on this gun. Uh, you can uh, search that, and uh, or I'll put a link to it down below. But there is a, uh, a review on the Walter PPS 9mm. I like it. It's uh, PPS is Police Pistol Slim, and uh, it, I've used it concealed carry. And I can interchange this one with my uh, uh, J-Frame uh, Snubby, uh, and uh, it's almost as comfortable. It's just a little bit bigger. And of course, it's got a, a bigger capacity for rounds. This holds eight in the in the, uh, in the uh, magazine and one in the chamber uh, for a total of nine, where my snubby's only got five. Okay, so uh, that's what we're using today. And once again, using my Remora holster. Now this happens to be the same size holster that fits my J-frame, fits this weapon as well, and uh, does a great job. So uh, let's go from there. Time to get serious. Funny, I was low on both my body shots and the headshot hit. So we're gonna try that again. Again, it's two shots to the body, reassess the threat, one to the head, if necessary.
Okay, friends, we uh, switch now to the uh, Snubby uh, Smith & Wesson 360. Uh, chamber than 357, but I'm only shooting 38 specials today. A lot cheaper. Uh, but it, this is my everyday carry, as well as I carry that PPS. And uh, you need to be proficient in both, if that's what you carry. Uh, again, target shooting is nice, but uh, if you're going to conceal carry, you need to practice from a concealed position and firing being on target. So. Uh, I got a number of speed loaders ready to go, so we're just going to go through these uh, set of speed loaders and uh, call it a day. Hang in there. Remember that the uh, Smiths, that the Snubby only has five rounds.
There you have it. That sucker's hot. Uh, I proved a couple of things today. Uh, that my modification on the uh, being able to get the, the speed loader in uh, works fine. Uh, as you can tell, that one of the things I had a problem with ejecting rounds uh, was severe before. It's getting a lot better. And that is my, my uh, gunsmith did tell me that as the gun wears a little bit, they will fall out easier. And that happens to be the case. So uh, we're just going to keep firing the gun, wear it in, and, uh, and I'm real happy with it. It's an M&P, uh, Smith & Wesson M&P 360. Just how much damage that I do, you can see the body shots are twice as much as the headshots but uh, uh, anyway that was my target well once again you can friend me on uh, Facebook at Firearm Pop you can find me on the web at FirearmPop.com and as always this is Firearm Pop be safe out there and God bless bye now